Welcome back to my channel Just Australia. Planning a move to Australia, or already there with a pending visa application. Then bridging visas, BVs, are likely on your radar. These temporary visas are crucial for staying lawful while your big move unfolds. But with 2024 bringing significant updates to the BV system, navigating the process can feel overwhelming. Fear not, fellow adventurers. This video is your one-stop shop for understanding the latest changes and their potential impact on your Australian journey. We'll unpack the bridging visa streamlining and what it means for clarity, processing times, and visa conditions. But that's not all. We'll also explore increased processing times, a focus on genuine applications, and the ever-evolving policy landscape. Whether you're applying for a bridging visa or already hold one, this video will equip you with the knowledge to navigate the system with confidence. So, buckle up and get ready to bridge the gap to your Australian dream. A key development in 2024 was the introduction of the Migration Amendment, Bridging Visas, Regulations to Bridging Visa Streamlining. This amendment, implemented in early 2024, aims to simplify and clarify the policy framework surrounding the Bridging Visa, Class WR, also known as the BVR Visa. The BVR is commonly used by individuals whose substantive visa applications are pending a decision or further information. The amendments aim to bring greater transparency and consistency to the BVR application process, making it easier for applicants to understand the requirements and navigate the system. Here's a breakdown of some potential implications of the bridging visa streamlining. Enhanced clarity. The amendments may provide clearer guidelines on eligibility criteria and the assessment process for BVR applications. This can improve predictability for applicants and potentially reduce processing times. Standardized conditions. The BVR may come with more standardized conditions attached, making it easier for visa holders to understand their rights and obligations while in Australia. Streamlined processing. The Department of Home Affairs DHA, might implement more streamlined processing procedures for BVR applications, potentially leading to faster decisions. However, it's important to note that the full impact of the bridging visa streamlining is still unfolding. It's advisable to consult with a registered migration agent for the latest developments and personalized advice on your specific situation. The bridging visa landscape in 2024 goes beyond the streamlining amendments. Here are some other noteworthy updates. Increased processing times. Due to a rise in visa applications overall, processing times for bridging visas, including the BVR, might be longer than usual. Be prepared for potential delays and plan accordingly. Focus on genuine applications. The DHA may be placing a stronger emphasis on ensuring the legitimacy of bridging visa applications. This could involve stricter scrutiny of supporting documentation and applicant circumstances. Evolving policy landscape. Immigration policies are subject to ongoing review and potential changes. Staying informed about the latest updates through official government sources or registered migration agents is crucial. With the recent changes, navigating the bridging visa process in 2024 requires staying informed and seeking professional guidance. Here are some resources to help you. The Department of Home Affairs website, DHA The DHA website provides the most up-to-date information on bridging visas, including eligibility requirements, application processes, and visa conditions. Registered migration agents. Consulting with a registered migration agent can be invaluable. They can provide tailored advice based on your unique circumstances and assist with the application process. The world of bridging visas encompasses various visa subclasses, each catering to specific situations. In the next video, we'll delve deeper into some of the most common bridging visa types and how the 2024 updates might impact them. By understanding these nuances, you'll gain a clearer picture of how the 2024 updates might influence your specific bridging visa situation. So, stay tuned for part 2, where we'll shed light on the critical bridging visa subclasses and empower you to navigate your Australian immigration journey with confidence. What are you waiting for then? Subscribe to this channel if you find the video interesting to be updated when we publish the next part tomorrow.